Hello friends, uh, welcome to freeprojects.com and this is my new project online e-learning portal and I have developed this project in Python version 2.7 and I have used the Django web uh, framework. Uh, the version is in Django 1.11 and for database I have used the MySQL and for connecting the database from the Django I have used the connector. You can get that connector from the MySQL website very easily. So for the front end design, I have used uh, the bootstrap theme for creating the front end design of this page. And also the, I have used many of the jQuery libraries to giving the project a good effects and animations. So you can see uh, the slider is going on the home page so i have used many of this type of uh, third party jquery library to making the project very good looking so you can see this is the wow effect so i have used the wow effect also once i load this page you can see that uh, all the blocks are loading very slowly so this is also a jquery library which i have used in this project so let's start uh, with the uh, front end first. Okay, so in this project, there are two types of user. First is the tutor and second one is a uh, student. So uh, this is the role based system and this menu will be changed according to the role. If tutor logins into the system, then this menu will be uh, displayed and rendered uh, as per the tutors uh, restrictions and the credentials and if students log into the system then this menu will be changed according to the user permissions so let's start with the functionality so this is the home page of the project and after that this is about us page so i have also added a simple slider on the about us page so this is the student login where a student will be able to log in and this is a tutor login where tutor will be able to log in after that this is a contact us page you can see that this is a contact us page and i have added uh, the <laughs> google map uh, for setting up your address pointer on the google map and let's start with the tutor login first so this is the tutor login and So this is the first page of after the tutor login. This is the home uh, and admin dashboard of the tutor. So you can see these are the modules which I have developed in this project. The add tutorial. So tutorial are those modules normally if you want to create a tutorial for the C, C++, Python, Django, then you can create the tutorial from that section. After that, add topics. This is the module. So from where you can create the topics and after that, add course for adding the course and the questions for adding the questions. So this project also contains the quiz system. After completing their tutorials and the sub course, uh, student will be able to uh, give the quiz. And after that, they will they will get their result on time so i have also developed that quiz system in this which you will see later so let's start go through the functionality one by one so this is also the menu where uh, all the functionalities are available so let's start with the add to uh, uh, these are also working so if you want to click on the add user then this will be a the page will be open so let's go one by one so this is a topic so you will be able to create a topic into any of the course so there are php or if there is a python course then you can see that four types of level beginner intermediate advanced and expert so you can see that there are four types of levels here so Student will have to complete the beginner level to go on the intermediate after that the advanced and the export level so there are four types of level student will not be able to jump to the export level without completing this past way so this all the functionality has been developed in this project so 
<coughs> you can add the topic name suppose in python how to install python and a description of that topic so this is the add topic page after that add tutorial so in this you will select the topic means for which topic you are going to add the tutorial suppose if i am going to how to install django and here you will enter the title and the content which you you want to add in that title after that this is the add course where you will able to add the course just like uh, any type of course java jsp python Django, flat machine learning each and everything you will be able to add from here and after that you will be able to add the topics in that course and then you will be able to add the tutorials in that topic <coughs> and then add question so you will be able to add the questions from here in the in that topic suppose if you want to add the question in any of the topic then you can select that topic and then after full question and the option one two three four and the correct answer that what will be the correct answer so this is the this is for the quiz system so once a student start quiz then uh, all the option will be displayed with the question or also uh, once he completes the quiz uh, the evaluation of that quiz will be displayed on time so next in turn add new user so uh, tutor will be able to add new user so this is the user role so what type of user tutor want to add so tutor or the student so if he add students then uh, the student role will be added into that user and if he adds the tutor then tutor permissions will be added in into that uh, user so next we start uh, let's go on the report session then this is the tutor report so you can see there are two of the tutors is available here and after that tutorials so this is the tutorial report so how to install django and if you click on the edit you will be able to see that what the contents are there in that topic and then result report so you can see that there is a student jayasama who has prepared three times in two times he is failed and one time he is passed if you want to see the result then you can click on the view details and that result will be displayed here okay so and if you again uh, see the parcel then all the answers will be okay so means the result is 100 percent means uh, if a student pass uh, give the correct answer of all question then he will be able to he will be passed and he will be uh, moved on to the second uh, level after that student report so this is these are the students of the system and you will be able to update the details from here and then topics report so all the topics are here so python django and all the topics are here you can edit and update topics you can also delete tap topics from here so this is the course report that what type of course are available in the e-learning platform and the questions report that what are the questions and for which topic that questions has been assigned and after that there is a my account section so uh, for updating your account the user who has logged into the system he will be able to uh, change their account details and after that the change password for changing the password of the system the login user and password and the logout functionality once you will log out then all the sessions will be destroyed from the Django and the Python so this is the first uh, user <coughs> Uh, demonstration so that is the admin with or a tutor so tutor is the super admin of the system where he will be able to perform in all type of operation in the system so let's uh, go through the with the student functionality so for student login click on the student login and log in as a student so student and the password is text so this is the student dashboard so you can see uh, there is a restriction uh, for the student it means once he starts login he will be able to see their only uh, functionality for which, for which he has permitted so let there is a my administration section so you can see that the uh, you can redact uh, you can open the section from here also and the uh, here also so you can see the course details here uh, so let's go on the dashboard first so course list so in that course list these are the courses 
and if you click on the view topics then all the topics will be displayed okay and after that if you click on the view details then all the uh, topic details will be uh, displayed here okay so this is the course list and that my result section so you will be able to see the uh, student will be able to see their own result also so let's start a exam first uh, so course list and then as to view topics okay and this is the view topic section uh, so how to install Django if you want to read the tutorial then just click on the read tutorials and you will be able to see that what these are the tutorials including serial wise once you click on the read article then the read article uh, section will be open and you can again go back and read that again on the next article and so on so once you complete this uh, tutorial then you can go in onto the dashboard and the course list and after that uh, the view tutorials sorry view topics and the start quiz so once you start the quiz so uh, you will be able to uh, uh, the student will give their quiz uh, and to check their uh, performance so let's start with so view topics and there's a start quiz so this is the quiz so uh, the first question is explain uh, these are the questions you can add a number of questions into a topic and if you add the questions into the topic then a student must have uh, given the full 100% uh, 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 correct answer for getting passed from this uh, level so let's start that is static url and some i am giving some random answers for this questions and submit quiz once you submit the quiz so i think there is some issue okay so uh, he will be able to see the answer uh, see their results just like uh, this one okay just like this one he will he will be able to see the answer so this is the project and if uh, you have any issue so if uh, so there is some issue i will fix this issue also so if you have any question then you can post uh, the questions into the comment and sure i will reply on that and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the regular uh, latest project uh, video updates Thanks, thanks very much.